Thank you so much, sir. Merry Christmas to you. He's out trying to protect this community, and he's hit by a suspected drunk driver, and he almost loses his life. This was not a simple accident. He was severely injured, and we were very blessed, and our prayers were answered, that he has a potential for full recovery, but it's a long recovery. And as Deputy Rod Reeds recovers, Christmas for him and his family will come early. In fact, it'll keep coming until the husband and father of three returns to work. By him not working full time, you know, most of us in law enforcement, um, we supplement our income with uh, part-time jobs. So now that uh, he's hurt, he's out of work, he can't work those part-time jobs. Dozens of Forsyth County volunteers, some deputies, some touched by Reef's story, held white buckets for hours. In bright vests with smiles and hopeful hearts, asking drivers and shoppers to help someone they don't even know. Thank you Thank so you. much. Christmas, medical bills, home bills, whatever they have. Wife just started a new job. There's a lot of things for this family. This is a man who wanted to come here so bad he took a pay cut from his former agency to come here. With an already tough stance on drunk driving, Sheriff Freeman says there's been an uptick in DUIs, so that tough stance has gotten tougher. If you want to drink, just don't drive. Pick up a phone, call Uber, call Lyft, find a DD, call me. I don't care, but don't get behind that wheel if you're drunk. Now we deal with a lot of you know risky situations, a lot of life and death situations, and of course that's what we're trained to handle. But uh, you know we still are just like everybody else. We still have families. Reefs could be back to duty in three to six months, but that would be in a limited capacity. In Forsyth, Deborah Tuff, 11 Alive News. All right, Deborah.